Hello, it's Karmatos, back from a busy weekend and here with a quick little one for you. It's a challenge deck video, and the challenge was when playing as few tactics as possible. So who's really good at playing troops? Lucretia, that's who. Yep. Let me get rid of this little box here. Lucretia, your troops cost one less. Come on, it's made for this. And give plus one plus one and heal one to a friendly troop. So then you just fill it with a bunch of your favorite troops. So this one's great because it's zero cost to draw a card. Use it to peck one damage, finish something off. Great. Hunters, just great neutral troop. Jubok, mandatory. There's a rifle section. Uh, the three or more on the toughness is important, because or on the health, because then you can hit them, survive, and heal, or etc. They can't uh, warlord bash it off the field so easy. So you're going to see that theme. Another draw with a 3 health. Ekratrez, 3 health himself, plus healing. 3 health for the 3-3. Three, 5-3 three. Three for that 3 health and stealth. So hit him for 5. Heal up becomes a 6-3 again. Uh, Karmix Reapers. Yeah, these are just uh, and Shmirnoff Warriors. Just good, uh, you know, spam the field a whole lot. You know, you can drop this one continuously and for every three energy you have if they ever have two troops you just spam this out keep your hand size big and watch them struggle to deal with all the four fours duke's just amazing firewalkers because i see other lucretia decks run it i threw it in joker company just seemed like a nice five five that could pick off some nasty stealth scenarios uh, there are some options I skipped over, potentially, like the Jam Troop for 5-4, or um, the Skatari, whatever, 4-5, to reveal a stealth. But I just slapped this together quickly, and it worked on the first try, so who can complain? I also missed out on the um, Infantry deal 2 damage at end of turn. So, oh, well. Mortar Carrier, come on, it's 2-7, lots of opportunity for heal. Mount Pharos, just a good... Easy to heal continuously, spam out those troops to hand at even cheaper. Uh, command Post, mostly ran this because I see a lot of other Lucretia decks run it, but it makes sense. Um, it's big, it's buff, you can heal it if they can't kill it in one turn, and you can just start spam buffing other friendly troops for frontline at the near end of game so you don't die. And yeah, it's just big and buff. Yuri the Seducer, just a good idea. Big powerful stops them from having attack strength allows all of your troops that you've built up into late energy to strike without repercussion and slayer of worlds because come on you got nothing but troops its own cost is reduced by one dropping that 15 15 is hilarious so i did one attempt with it and it worked instantly and here it is and funny enough it's against a heal vulcan at least we're gonna see a. Your army is nothing next to my will to win. At least twelve healing out of him, and a lot of survival. So maybe that's just standard Vulcan now. So yeah, see, we got that nice first turn. If you saw the curve at the beginning, it was a very nice, lots of threes, then fours, then you know, it had a pretty nice linearity to it, where 3 being the most common, therefore 2. And so long as you have Shmirnoff or McCormick, you'll always be able to keep something coming. Oh, you just go for the heal. Knowing that it's a 4-3 means that he'll have to double tap it, and he will, because he doesn't want to see a greater demon. Something about that sacrifice, get out a free troop that just spooks people. He just took four damage to the face to do that. Just remove the chance that he can clear my board in any way. Ah, another infantry. So, so long as I don't put something out with three attack, this sacrifice is not going to go off. I was really hoping that would have hit him, but can't win them all. So now the best he can do is two damage to himself and then set himself up to be killed by that, and then I can 
Ekratrez it to death or see what I draw. Yeah, look at that. That one troop got off three damage and consumed his entire turn. Soaked seven damage, used the card, also did another two in the uh, pack to him, so. But yeah, just keep the board state dominance. I'm willing to sacrifice the heal and Ekratrez to do it. Very good play for him. Especially with uh, nine health just wiped out. <laughs> now we have an opportunity to get eight Father damage Mead. ahead of Ekratrez, because four is going to be dealt there, and I suspect he's going to face bash Ekratrez. <laughs> and yeah, just drop things that have the backlash, so if he kills them, I get some value. There's our first big heal. And by Ekratrez. That Ekratrez killed a troop and did 8 damage and soaked in attack. So, now this, that's the game winner. You can't blow up my troops if you can't attack, and you can't attack if you got 0 attack. So, oof. That's really going to cause the beatdown, because lucky me, he's not going to draw the insta-kill he needs. Ah, plus one extra, you know, survivor. See, good opportunity for that. Now I can peck that off, take a little self-face damage. And then bash him for 10. Hope he likes getting a troop. 11 and 12. Lots of survivor. Up a couple of Shmirnoffs. I don't. Yeah, I can't Slayer of Worlds yet. Finish that off. I don't mind taking the health damage. Just proc that. Get rid of any chance he has to kill my Uriel. Got the two damage he needed on Uriel for the upcoming Hunter. Yep. And then he gets his attack strength back. I'm sure I have a Slayer of Worlds, but it's ridiculous to play it because if I do, he will just give himself Survivor beforehand, attack it, give himself Survivor again. So he's got himself in his combo, but it's game over. I got 6 damage on the board, plus 3 for the last 3 survivor. He's dead. Ta -da! And that's how we do this. When playing as few tactics as possible. If you don't have any in the deck and you win, you pass. So I hope you enjoyed this quickie. Uh, this was Karmatos. If you like this, like it. If you want to see more like it, subscribe. I'm going to get some more meme decks out here soon. Don't worry. Just been a busy, crazy life. Uh, thanks for watching.